Let's begin. Maybe in this song, you shouldn't start by saying... Said it, I know that you mad. I've emptied the clip over friendly or jabs. You mentioned my seed and I deal with his dad. I gotta go bad. I gotta go bad. Mm. Okay, okay. So he mentions how uh, Kendrick took away his N-word pass. Attempted to take away his N-word pass. Mm. Yeah, try, 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 mm. try. We actually heard this. We heard this in the first Drake diss. Push-ups at the end and then it gets cut off. So we're getting the full version, I guess. It's also seven and a half minutes and I think Kendrick's was six and a half minutes so we're eating good uh you know what my favorite part about all these diss tracks j cole just keeps catching strays ever since he's apologized he's just getting destroyed just like how metro nigga slime for his main squeeze metro boomin getting dissed once again i might be wrong about a lot of things or i might just skim over some things guy because I don't know it. That's why I'm going to need your guys' help to type in the comments what I missed. Let me know. Don't even go back to your hood and plant no money trees. Money Say trees you reference? Hate the girls I fuck, but okay. what you really mean? I've been with black and white and everything Actually, in between. The, beat, you the, black the beat's kind of fire. Up a mix queen. Never hold your son and tell him say cheese. Damn, okay, okay. Left the kids out of this, don't blame me. He's hitting back. He's hitting back for the, the fatherhood. <laughs> Yeah, he's, he's getting pretty direct now. He's not holding back. <laughs> Referencing his own song. Okay. Referencing his hide again. Knew it was smoke when Abel hit us with the serenade. Nigga say, uh, uh. Almost started reaching for my ways. Try. We got a able diss, The weekend getting dissed. He didn't really go in too bad. He's not he's not going too hard, I feel like. I feel like he's still holding back. But also we're only a fourth of the way into the song. So things might change up. He's going at other people instead of Kendrick, I feel like. Oh, beat switch, okay. First beat switch. I'm assuming we're gonna get a bunch. Look. If Drake shooters doing TikToks, nigga, really shooting in your gang, that's me. Mm, okay. Shit shot, nigga, can't listen to the stick talking falsetto, save it for a hip hop, nigga, young okay. nigga, be a home dog, you a souvenir out the gift shop, nigga, still mad about okay. that one whole week. Can we just appreciate Kendrick? Whoever wins this rap beef, can we appreciate the fact that Kendrick got Drake to actually start rapping again? <laughs> And can we appreciate Drake for getting Kendrick to actually drop again? This is unbelievable. Who's next on the list? Which one of my so called oh, niggas? Which one else? of my so called See, niggas? See, the, the, the problem with this is it's not Kendrick. He's not only roasting Kendrick. I mean, he is, but he's roasting everyone else. And then is is because of that? I feel like he's not giving his attention to Kendrick. Weekend music getting played in all the spots where boys got a little more pride. Weekend getting dissed again. This feels more like a weekend diss now, Jones. <laughs> boys got a little okay. more pride. That's why all your friends dip into it, letting a plan just to find a tour guy. Damn. Run your fucking bread, need to buy some more chains for some more. Again guys. with the weekend. Let me find bro. another street nigga I could take to the game court side. Pluto shit made me sick to my stomach. We ain't never really been through it. Lean away here fucking lane, so I know oh, no. be influence. No one is safe. Niggas had a plan only hitting hard when baby king go. put his pen to it. Ooh, allegations. This is where it gets interesting. He's accusing Kendrick for he's a, he's a cute how do I phrase this he's just saying baby Keem writes Kendrick's songs sometimes and those are the only good ones mm. beat switch once more okay okay hey, Kendrick just opened his mouth mm. someone go hand him a Grammy right now where's your uncle at this is definitely this was definitely like the most recent recorded one. This is like, I feel like the other stuff he already had recorded, which was just an extension of push-ups. This one, I feel like he recorded after Euphoria came out. And I feel like now we can finally, now he can finally go after Kendrick. Cause I feel like the rest of this was just like everyone else, which by the way, it's good. It's not too personal though, per personal. It didn't feel like any of that would actually hurt any of the people he dissed. Maybe Metro. Maybe The Weeknd. That would be amazing. If Weeknd drops a diss, a Drake diss, 
But I don't think he will. I think everyone else is just done. Uh, let's begin. Cause I wanna talk to the man in the house. A cease and desist is for hoes. Mm, yep. Can't listen to lies that come out of your about. mouth. You call the two pack of steak. Yeah, he's, he's, he's addressing it across the bar. I'm losing perspective on people. Oh, wait, wait. Kendrick begged Tupac Estate to sue him. This he's talking about the Taylor made freestyle, which I had completely forgotten about until just now. Interesting. Interesting. So he's talking about, hey, wait, what did he say about the cease and desist? Can't listen to lies that come out of your mouth. He's saying I never had a cease and desist on the like that record, which Kendrick said. Okay, okay. You caught it too back to stay. But now we're saying, now we're assuming Kendrick is saying the truth about this, or Drake is telling the truth about Kendrick doing this. Well, well, I don't know. We'll see. I'm losing perspective on beef. Okay. Boy, when the same beat and I kill you for fun. Your daddy okay. got robbed by top. Damn. You stunning and Wayne like father like son. Damn. Set up the play. Craziest line in the song. You write about fuck the big three. It's only Big D, and there's video proof. <sighs> He's talking about his. Uh, I'm, I'm not even gonna talk about it. Well, that's crazy. That's how crazy. Big three. It's only Big D, and it's video proof. <laughs> My son should go play at the park. Two light skin kids. The shit will be cute unless you don't wanna be okay. seen with anyone that isn't blacker than you. Talking you about the race thing, yeah. Got it. The black of the bag, the sweet of the juice. Okay. We get that you like to put gin in your juice. We mm. get that you think that you bishop and juice. Mm. When you put your hands on your girl, oh no, is it self defense because she's bigger than you? You're... That is that is insane. Oh my god, Drake is <laughs> again with the uh, Kendrick is short. Pose in 2015, but oh, don't no. want to make her your actual wife. Ooh. I'm guessing this wedding ain't happening right because we know the girls that you actually like. The darkest secrets are okay. coming in light. It's all on your face, like what happened to Mike. Oh, oh. it's all making sense. Maybe I'm Prince and you. Okay, okay. Drake is actually snapping on this. He, he's, he's, he, I feel like this stuff might actually hurt Kendrick. <laughs> Not the entire last five minutes of the song, but this, this last segment is, is where the gems are. Mike, Michael was praying his features were changed, so people believe that he's actually white. Top one making Damn, okay. features for change. They hired a crisis management team to clean up the fact that you beat on your queen. Ooh. The picture you painted ain't what it seemed. You did. That was, that was an insane ending. Okay, well, then that was really good. <laughs> he obviously has a big responsibility on his shoulders. He has to go for every single one, and he did. He went for Metro, Weekend, Rick Ross, Future, and. In doing so, he kind of didn't go that hard on Kendrick, but then the last beat switch, the last two minutes, he was like, nah, this euphoria shit, I'm gonna show him. And I, I feel like some of the things he said were kind of savage, not gonna lie. Now we're gonna be moving on to Kendrick's diss. 